Well, it's kind of a cool June day. Sporting the leather jacket in June with the top down, that's not right. But we're on our way for some hot dogs over at my old spot in Marlboro, a little place called Dizey's Dogs. Dizey's Dog is located at 420 Maple Street in Marlboro, Massachusetts. It's in the parking lot of the Gold's Gym. This is where I used to be. Press the button. And you can see she's got a nice little dining room set up. Very cute. Diane's got full power right at the right at her trailer. Comes in handy. What's your name? Diane Dupre. And you're the owner of Dizey's Dogs? Yes, I am. Well, my part owner. My brother owns GMS Automotive and he owns half of this as well. Okay, now this trolley has an interesting story. Tell us about it. This trolley was originally built in the 60s in Everett, Mass, where one of the first all steel trolleys were built. And, um, and this was built in the 60s. It was a woman was selling coffee out of it in Framingham for about 15 years and went to sell sell it and I had owned one already at that time and I did not purchase this until about, about a year and a half ago, two years ago. And I love it. It's really cute, great size, not too small, just perfect for a couple people to work out of it. I also do functions with it, do parties, birthday parties and, and uh, it stays here. I'm going into the inner sanctum. Here we have a nice little grill where she's making up some burgers, or a burger. And we got a couple of steam wells here. There's the Arnold Palmer dispenser. And then, uh, what is this thing here? Just another hot... This is the cheese sauce that I have. Okay. This is just melted butter to do my buns with. Okay. This fella requested a melted bun. Pastry tray. Some pastries. Fresh ice for the lemonade. Excuse me. And it's a nice little rig. And she's got our sinks here. Mm -hmm. Little cash register. Very nicely done. And then there's our condiment tray. A lot of jalapenos. Woof. Yes. I've been here since last August and shut it down for the winter due to the heavy snow and then just reopened it again about a month and a half ago. What do you think it takes to be successful in the hot dog business? Honestly, I think I think to have a good location is one. It's very important. And I also think personality. I think you have to. I've seen other vendors I think you have to be bubbly, you have to be interested in what they come in their stories when they're talking to you, and obviously good food, but I also think uh, the location is very important. When I owned a couple other trolleys, one didn't do as well, and the location over in Natick area was, um, was not as successful. So I think location's big, you have to have the personality, and great food. Hey, how are you? How are you doing? Good. Uh, good Joey Dogs, it's onion. You've got it. You want the combo with the chips cooking yeah, in the drink? I haven't been much of a Bruins fan until this year. But I grew up with them. My dad's um, best friend years ago was Don Cherry. Oh, really? Yeah. Really? My dad owned uh, car dealerships, and they the Bruins would buy all their vehicles from my dad. What do we got here, Diane? This is the two dogs with the toasted buns that I always do, chili and onions for this nice fellow over here. And I'm going to make it a combo with chips, homemade chocolate chip cookie, and a soda.
And do you make your own chili? I make my own chili. Homemade, all right. Homemade. It's not too spicy. Not... Hey, how are you? Good, yourself? Good. Happy Monday. Thanks. Yeah. What are you in the mood for? Sausage, cheeseburger, dogs. Ooh. I have the turkey dinner wrap special I today as well. That. Actually, it's on wheat bread. I'm trying to do a little bit healthier, so I don't do the wraps anymore. It's really good. And help yourself to cold soda right there. My wife would kill, kill me if she saw me coming in the end. <laughs> Eating this food. <laughs> That's too funny. Yeah. This is the sausage combo. This is my jumbo sausage with peppers and onions roasted. And this nice fellow got spicy mustard on it. Mm. And a nice soft bun. That looks delicious. Where do you get your bread, Diane? I get my bread usually over at BJ's. Yeah. That's where I'm buying it right now. Yeah. Okay. Hello? Hi. Hi. Sure. What would you like on it today? Oh, You got it. Spicy or yellow mustard? Not spicy. Oh, okay. He's a good guy. So you like hot dogs, sir? I do. First time here? First time here, yes. What made you want to stop in? The sign. I'm going by. It's yeah. That's simple. You know what? Business without a sign is a sign of no business. <laughs> That's probably true. <laughs> 525. Like a slice of yeah. it? Would you like Not a that? slice? <laughs> I have a slice of American and a slice of Swiss. I can do either one. Can I get both? Yes, you can. See? You want a slice on one hot dog? I'm going to take a picture of the food. Yeah, <laughs> okay. that would be great. You got it. Just one dog. Do you want the chips or anything with it, hon? Um, yeah, I'll take the combo, the I guess. The combo? The nice tea. Okay. Really? Can... What do we have here? This Ooh. is, this is um, a combo with a cookie and chips and American cheese and Swiss on my hot dog with a nice cheese And you are, the, you are the cheese lady, huh? I am the cheese lady. If you have to take a picture, you can. Just make it, you have to do it real quick. Okay. There's the cheese lady. Smile. <laughs> <laughs> I'll have to tell Nate you stop by. Right. Thanks. Thanks. Nice to see you. Right. Hi, guys. Hello. How are you? Good, how are you? It does look good, doesn't it? Yeah, you know what? I may try that. <laughs> I like the Swiss. I'm looking at that. <laughs> Take care. What can I start for you guys? We've got sausages, cheeseburgers, the hot dogs, chili. I think I'm going to take a hot dog. Sure. You, can you put cheese on it? I would love to. A slice Sorry. like that, nice lady. Oh, I didn't see it. I have melted cheese or I have a slice of American or a slice of Swiss. I can wrap it in. A slice of Swiss. Doesn't that sound good? Yep. And what do you call that with the uh, Swiss cheese on it? What kind of dog is that? Well, the Nate dog is a Swiss cheese with mustard. Okay. That's named after your but son, right? The yes, that's after my son. But that yeah. last customer, the cheese lady, just made up the cheese dog. <laughs> <laughs> now, you have to tell me if you like this coleslaw because it's homemade. Oh. Wow. And I'm really picky about coleslaw. So what, so what are your coleslaw, you know... My little parameters. Well, tell me if this is good. Here, come try right. that for me. I don't like a lot of vinegar, so try that. All right. And I had a lady come last week, and I sold her a huge pot. It's of really good. It. Isn't that good? Not too sweet either. That's what it is. It's not sweet. I don't know. It's not too tart with the vinegar. Yep. And it's been really popular. Please. And what can I start for you, hon? Oh, uh, now you've got some of that homemade coleslaw, sure. and it uh, looks like the cheese lady has started a trend with the Swiss cheese, I think huh? She has. <laughs> Looks good. Like Swiss or American? Okay, I would like. Uh, what would you like? Two hot dogs and one uh, bowl of chili. Okay, great. Andrew, what would you like today? Uh, can, I, can I get a chili cheese dog? Chili cheese. Would you like a combo or just the dog with that? Uh, just the dog. Just the dog. Just the dog. And I'm gonna have. I'm going to have a chili dog, too. Or actually, what's what's your signature dog, Diane? The signature dog I usually have is the Red Hot Chili Dog. It's all hot spicy. That's been really popular. The Russian dog with Russian dressing, black pepper, and chopped up pickles is also popular. But the chili and cheese is usually the trademark for young and old. That's usually what I eat. Okay, I'll do a chili dog. All right, time to chow down. Not, no. <laughs> Arnold Palmer alert. Arnold Palmer alert. <laughs> Who wants an Arnie Parmy? <laughs> you know, not everyone's seen that movie, right? <laughs> mm, 
homemade Arnold Palmers. Yummy. Arnold Palmer alert. Arnold Palmer alert. <laughs> I'm about to have a bite out of my chili dog from Dizey's Dog. It's on a nice grilled bun. What kind of hot dogs do we use, Diane? I use the KM 8 to 1, Rob. KMs. My favorite. And fresh homemade chili. Looks delicious. Mmm. Piping hot. The chili's not too spicy, but it's got a little bit of a zing to it. But not like burn, not burn your eyeballs zing, but a, a nice little zing. Hot dog's nice and hot, nice good snap. Excellent. Mm. So I must say, this is an adorable little trailer. It's a nice piece of Boston history. Diane serves fantastic food. The chili's great. She's got my criteria for a good hot dog. Hot, good chili, and grilled buns. So I definitely give Dizey's Dogs two thumbs up. All right, you did it. Was that so hard? <laughs> no, it was easy. <laughs> Thanks for stopping by, guys.